Hey everybody, my name is David Wallowidnik. I'm the resident cocktail stylist at Taste Magazine. This is a beautiful, fun cocktail that I'm about to show you. It's the start of patio season here in BC, and what better to celebrate it with than the Southside cocktail. Fun little backstory on this cocktail. It first appeared very similar to this in 1916, 1917 as the Southside Fizz. Essentially the same drink, but with soda involved. A few years later, during the US Prohibition, Al Capone and his gang reportedly liked this cocktail to consume with the gin that they were smuggling into Chicago. And the south side of Chicago was represented through this cocktail. What do we have in it? Well, we're gonna put a little bit of Bombay Sapphire Gin, a little bit of one-to-one -one simple syrup, that's one part sugar, one part water, and a little fresh lemon juice. We're gonna throw some mint leaves in the shaker, we're gonna shake it up and strain it out. Super easy to do. So, we'll first grab our shaker tin, and to that, we're going to add two ounces of Bombay Sapphire. It's a beautiful, balanced, London Dry style gin, 10 botanicals in total, and equal parts of this one-to-one -one simple syrup and lemon juice. Each is going to be three quarters of an ounce, which is 22 to 22 and a half mils, just like that. Let's get a little bit of mint in here. Let's grab a bunch of leaves. You don't need to be too gentle with it. You can actually take the leaves, the stems and all. We're gonna give it a nice vigorous shake. Any sort of bitter, kind of astringency that comes out of those leaves is going to be reduced by a little bit of sweetness, a little bit of acidity. Get some ice in this shaker. You wanna add a fair amount of ice to this because you wanna actually have the ice be the muddler to give that agitation and to kind of really extract that mint flavor out of everything. And a nice vigorous shake. See how frosty that is on the outside? That's what you want. You want this to really, really be nice and cold. A nice hard shake brings out the flavor of the mint. And we don't want all that mint in the glass. So use a fine strainer and strain it out. You see we've got some beautiful color out of that mint. Such a gorgeous green color there. And let's get a nice little piece of mint to garnish with. Just something like that. And that is a Southside cocktail. Pick up a copy of Taste Magazine for this recipe and many more. The issue is free, available at all the BC liquor stores. So go out and get your copy today. This is David signing off and I look forward to seeing you again soon.